frustrating. Hello. How do you like my new hat? You wanted to speak with me, mother? I had hoped to speak with you alone, Natsai. Your message mentioned your concern about an unusual creature that was spotted in the woods near Hogsmeade. That could have been anything. You know what it was, Natsai. I am allowed to leave the castle. I am always careful, mother. Careful? Mm. Officer Singer disagrees. She sent me an owl telling me that you have been trying to collect evidence of some kind against dark wizards. Well, yes. She berated me for not keeping a closer eye on you. And she is right. I do not want you visiting Hogsmeade for the near future. But mother! My little gazelle, you are well-intentioned, but you must not meddle in the affairs of dangerous people. If someone had meddled in Matabilaland, father would still be with us. Ah. Uh. I must get to class. Perhaps your friend can get you to listen to reason. So frustrating. Teachers. Children. She as never a listens to me. She called you her little gazelle. Is that a term of endearment where you're from? It is specific to me. <sighs> I am the unusual creature in Hogsmeade, she mentioned. Ah. Self transfiguration is not taught at Hogwarts. So I am gently discouraged from practicing it. However, I am an Animagus. Ah, and it is in my gazelle form that I have been able to wander the Highlands rather freely until now. Much to my mother's chagrin. That is how I yes, managed to is on really a British animal. So I, I understand now why she's very about that. Because Animagus are, uh, they are not re re really trusted. How does it feel to transform into an animal? Well, the first time, it can be a bit unnerving. I felt a kind of searing pain and a strong double heartbeat. But it gets easier the more you do it. I no longer feel any pain, and I must say, I find a sense of comfort in the double heartbeat. And I love being able to view the world from a different perspective. Were you born an Animagus, or did you learn to become one? Animagi are not born. The process is quite elaborate. It involves holding a mandrake leaf in one's mouth for an entire okay, month. Okay, they are not born. Then placing the leaf in a crystal phial so that it is imbued with moonlight. Then adding one of your own hairs. And that is just the beginning. Self-transfiguration is common among students at Wagadu. But Professor Weasley considers it much too dangerous to teach at Hogwarts. So African wizards and witches are like, they are more like animagus and they less practice uh, spellcasting with the band. Can you choose what form your animagus will take? Oh no, a person's animagus form is determined by their personality. My mother is convinced that my form is a gazelle because I adapt well to any situation. I believe it is because I can sense danger and keep my wits about me. Now the nickname makes sense. What an extraordinary ability to have. It is. I love transforming, but Mother is less enthusiastic about it. She says that no creature, especially one as rare as a gazelle, should be bounding about where poaching has become so well, prevalent. Oh, she has kind of <sighs> point. She claims that she has foreseen tragedy befall me in my gazelle form. But she has used her sight to control me too many times. I no longer believe it. Yes, she's she's uh, yeah, she's teaching the um, prophesizing the future. We're making good progress. We can't quit now. I agree. I have never considered quitting, even for a moment. You could have fled the moment you discovered that Rookwood, Gryffindor, Hallow and Randwalk were after you, but you did not. I choose to act as you have. I must deal with Rookwood and Harlow, not hide from them. <laughs> My mother cannot know where I am all the time. <laughs> Thank okay. you for okay. being here during that rather awkward conversation. All right. Okay, now, now we know more about her. Go to talk to Poppy. A 
Sometimes it seems all roads lead to Hogsmeade. How do you like my new hat? I didn't keep you waiting, did I? Not at all. I was just at the post office. Gran told me to expect a package, but it looks as if she forgot to send it. She didn't send me an owl this week either. Perhaps she's busy with her research. Or maybe I need to rescue, rescue her, her as well. What was she sending you? Only some feed she's been developing. I was going to give it to Professor Howen for the measles. What kind of research is she doing? It varies from week to week, but it's always to do with creatures. Last week she was studying leg knots in Plimpies. What did you find out about the dragon you were tracking? I realized that she didn't know the poachers had her egg. So when she left Horntail Hall, she would have headed straight to her nest. I went back to the tent and tracked her flight. How do you track a dragon long after she's gone? Tree canopies, burn marks, things like that. Well done. You certainly know what you're doing. I can't be certain, but I have an idea of one place she may have been heading. I thought we might go and see it for ourselves. Of course. Shall we leave now? If that's all right, I want to see how she's faring if she had a collar on. And she's likely frantic about her egg. Okay, now, now, and now I know where the lag, lag was coming. Not from Here Hogwarts. I do think this is where we'll find her. The terrain's typical of where the breed would nest. I suspect it's how the poachers found her to begin with. They likely camped here and logged her patterns. Perhaps nabbed her first and then her egg. Dragons are hard enough to wrangle, let alone maternal ones. You got all of that from simply standing here? You'd be surprised how easy it is to think like a poacher. Shall we see if she's home? We only need to return her egg. That sounds straightforward enough. We should be in and out. It's danger of with the poachers once kids don't all. do this at home. I don't suppose you've thought about keeping it, have you? No, it belongs to her. Keeping it will make me just as bad as the poachers. If you're right about finding her here, how do we go about returning the egg? Her nest will likely be in the heart of her den, which she will be keeping guard over. It might also be more charred than anywhere else, I imagine. Well then, let's find our dragon and return her egg. Wonderful. If she sees us flying about, she might take it as a sign of aggression or food. We should stay on foot. Oh, and one more thing. Let's not agitate her. Goodness knows she's been through enough already. I'm ready when you are. Amor, there she is, above us. She did make it home safe. Oh, good. It looks as if she wasn't collared like the other dragons. Okay, that's nice, I think. Well, she doesn't seem to have spotted us yet. Let's hope it stays that way. At least until we've done what we came to do. I 
wonder how many they brought to capture her. At least ten, usually. Okay, apparently I blew the fur away, so it's not... Can't, can't, can't collect it. There's some kind of cave there. There she is again. Yeah. She's breathtaking. From a distance. Yes. I see the bridge wasn't spared her wrath either. Good thing it's fixable. All right, so we need to fix the fix the, fix the actual bridge. Fantastic. Apparently spellcasting doesn't remove my cloak. Or is it dependent on the what what kind of magic I'm hmm, I wonder how good her eyesight is. Probably good. I beg your pardon. I don't imagine the poachers fed her well. And from a distance, we probably look exactly like sheep to her. Hebrideans love sheep. Uh -huh. oh, lucky for us. Watch your step. Pity. She must have been starved to pick off a grab horn. Or just raring for a fight. Okay. Ceramic mask. Quiet, what was that? Run ahead. Whenever you're ready, I'll find your lead. I'll draw her attention. Follow when it's safe. I don't suppose this is safe. Shooting two at. Keep at it. Can 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 can't be used magic or something. Not a warm welcome. It's well, a little too warm if you ask yeah, me. Yeah, a little too warm. I don't suppose she listened to reason. 
I'd normally try, but we're well past that. There's the nest. We're almost there. Why is every bridge here broken? Repairer. I don't know. Uh, maybe because of the dragon. Now, if we just return her egg, we can hopefully make it out without too much fuss. Or then maybe not. We got a dragon. <laughs> that was brilliant. And did you see how clever? She left us perfectly unharmed. Creatures are a lot cleverer than most people realize. That's what Gran always says. The important thing is that we survived it. And we returned her egg. Thank you for doing this with me. Wouldn't blame you one bit if you wanted to head back to the castle and never think about dragons she, she's again. She's taking us to the really danger of dates. Shall we head back? I'm ready if you are. I am. After our dragon rescue at Horntail Hall, I half expect to be ambushed by poachers any time I'm not in the castle. Understandable. We did sabotage their fighting ring and steal a dragon egg from them. True. True. So why haven't they come after us? It's not like them to let things lie. Unless... Unless what? Unless they haven't let things lie. Oh no, I can't believe I didn't see it. We need to leave. I need to send an owl. I thought my owl might pique your interest. Yeah. I came as soon as I could. I'd been so preoccupied by all that happened with Ominous and the catacomb, not to mention my uncle's reaction, that I'd almost forgotten what it was that struck me about that triptych. Okay. This is the view painted on the canvas that was left on it. That's incredible. You know this area well. And while I was waiting for you, I scouted around and discovered an abandoned mine nearby, surrounded by Ranrock's loyalists. Do you think there's a connection to the triptych? I've no idea, but perhaps they're searching it, the way they did Brookwood Castle and Isadora's Manor. How do we want to handle this? We need to see what they're doing, but let's not draw their attention. Very well. And I still have that rune symbol we found on the triptych. If there is a connection, I suspect we'll see that symbol again. Fair. After you. Quietly now. Quietly. There they are up ahead. I'll let you lead. Revenio. No one enters this mine. Kill anyone who...
did we have that? Get it the explosive barrel. They were somewhere uh, upgrade to the stupid fee. Perfect totalus. Okay, not stupid. Perfectus. Perfect. Petrificus totalus. So we can actually uh, several at the time. It's somewhat useful at times. Reach the entrance of the mine. So this is just a cave. This is not the mine. These are not the droids you are looking for. So this is some kind of antechamber. Nothing interesting. I think there should be some kind of effect this is from going well. We make a good team. We do at that. From using the uh, dark magic, because uh, about Tom Riddle. Uh, the, uh, Once again, we can fight our way through or be discreet. In, in a book, he which one I he, but choose. he was this uh, described that he had actually changed when he was a young man and. I tried to apply to the uh, defense of dark uh, arts teacher uh, job, so that's why he cursed it. But but he he had like visibly well, changed. Best meal I've had in years. No, I mean it. I don't think I should need to eat again till next week. <laughs> <stay tell us. laughs> Relative term, <laughs> it is, and that was relatively fun. Revelio.
I should tell you. Rumor is this mine was closed long ago due to an infestation of spiders. Nice. How nice. <laughs> yeah. That's that's what I said. Uh. Seen before. That's the st For better or for worse, we're in. Mr. Dallas. All around. This mine looks like a tomb. It was closed after accidents were reported. Revenue. Now I see why. Maybe it, it is it is a tomb. Luxurious, but not really good stats here. I don't see any goblins in these webs. Too disgusting for even a spider to prey on. Yeah. And boss fight. I know I heard something that time. Oh, well, something <laughs> made a sound. Must have been me. Loyalists are in here. <sighs> Too many. They definitely think there's something here they want. <sighs> Sleek dwelling clothes. Akio. Wingardium Leviosa. <sighs> I think this uh, selection of spells has pretty, <sighs> pretty useful. It has been really useful for this game so good kudos for game designers it's no wonder spiders give people goosebumps uh -huh. could be the hairy legs or the solar size or the venomous fangs or the fact they eat people in qualities really <laughs> smashing <laughs> smashing yeah. I can counter <laughs> stairs actually. Bombarda. Confringo. Confringo is like more like Spitfire. Oh no. Can 
and I change it to the let's see. <laughs> Easy boss fight. Yes. Levitating potion. We're making quick work of them. Professor Hecate would be proud. Lots loyalists have all but declared war. Lumos. Lumos. Devil's snare seems to thrive in darkness. Lumos. Perhaps it doesn't care for light. Uh, what are you doing, Sebastian? Lumos. Okay. Come here. He was he was stuck at the corner. Come on. Try to get here. Stop fooling around. Yeah. Yeah, his pathfinding AI is not really working right now. Lumos. Okay. I think we are going to continue without him. Have a fun with the Devil's Snare. Cleared the room. You're not a bad chap for a Slytherin. You Gryffindors don't have a monopoly on bravery, you know. <laughs> Revelio. So there's one here, second floor actually. Now. Oh. We can have a look around in peace. Confringo! Accio! Wingardium Leviosa! So let's drop that there. Spider Fang. Revelio! So there's a two. Confringo! 
two locks here. And third here. Off the cavern door. Ranrock's loyalists never knew to look for it. It's a, there's probably four of them. More room symbols. Revelio. It. I can find three, but where's the fourth one? Uh, there's three basically in this side of the room. And if this is designed in an evil way, you need to run around a bit. What I would do... Is put one, one, one at the These rooms must be right side somehow. here. Try casting at them more quickly. Revelio. Ah, okay. Now I understand. Maybe. Wasn't expecting that. Okay, so, yeah. It opened this for a moment. Quieter than a jobber What's a jobber now? What like. do you have there? A journal entry by Isadora. Plagued Hopefully, it. it will help us unravel more of this mystery. Revelio. Another passageway. We should search the room first. Sebastian, I think I found something. A canvas piece. Brilliant. Our efforts weren't in vain after all. Still. Something about this place feels odd. What? What did you notice? Revelio. If the triptych led us here to find this bit of canvas, we can probably assume that Isadora Morganark was here. She seems to have been everywhere. But if she was using the Undercroft, and the cellar beneath her manor in Feldcroft. Why would she create this space? And why hide it behind cryptic rune symbols? And ancient magic that no one but you could see? Isadora and Percival Rackham, another of the Keepers, could see traces of ancient magic too. Rackham? I haven't heard his name before. His are some of the memories I've seen. I don't think he and Isadora saw eye to eye on how this magic should be used. Well, this is all rather baffling. Let's take the canvas back to the triptych. Perhaps the answers are there. This place is odd, to be sure. But I'm fascinated by it. Now, for the trek back out of here and to Hogwarts. Hmm, just thinking. Tää on hyvä peli. Tää on hyvä peli. This, this is a good game. And now for the moment of truth. It has to fit. Let's see what happens. Please tell me you recognize the location in this bit of canvas. The good news is I do, in fact. And the bad news? We're in for more trouble. How much more trouble? I know that coast. Ranrock has taken over a huge mine in the surrounding area. Mara and Weem has suffered for it. It's as bad as Feldcroft's become. Should we head there now? We should wait. Why? 
All this time, we've been a step behind Ranrock. I may know someone who could help us get ahead. Who is that? A friendly goblin. He wants no part in Ranrock's fight. A friendly goblin? You know goblins cursed my sister to shut her up. Said she should be seen and not heard. I do, but not all goblins are... Not all goblins what? Have you forgotten, Feldcroft? Have you forgotten the mine we just went through? No, Sebastian, I haven't. You're not listening to me. Why would I listen to someone so ignorant? Perhaps your uncle was right about you. You don't know when to stop. Oh, I do know when to stop. Unbelievable. Not really. <laughs> Been on only by by Hello, luck. Samantha. Are you here for someone as caught? I am. I'm hoping to get my brother out here soon too, since thanks to you, he's recovered from his um vegetative state. Glad to hear it. Yep. In all fairness, I must warn you that I am frightfully good. Shall we begin? Yes, I'm ready to play. Then let's get summoning. I, I suppose there's something nice. If you actually complete this. Other this Accio. computer opponent is actually doing a bit randomly these things, so well that works. What was I thinking? That works for me. Accio. That kind of works. That was sensational. Akio. Yes. <laughs> now we just need to play as good as she is doing. Yeah, it's 30 points. Apparently, it's a green day. Did she just give me yes! points? No, she didn't. I'm, I'm st okay, I'm st st still in lead. Akio. I actually, uh, yeah, okay. So yeah, different, definitely more points this time. After your poor show against Natty in class, I thought I could beat you. Appears I overestimated myself. Don't say that, Samantha. You're a fine player. Well, that's very kind of you. Let's just say if I'm good, then you're better. I happen to know who you're up against next, and she's no shy opponent. Best of luck. Okay. <laughs>